Hello, thank you very much for checking this channel out. I appreciate you sharing your time. So I'm Jane. Hey. Um, <laughs> I wanted to hop on here for a moment and briefly talk about what I'm picking up on right now. So starting in a few days around, I think this, I don't know, it may be now, either way, all the planets are gonna be in direct motion. So none in retrograde, which I think has been going on that none have been in retrograde. However, it just kind of clicked in with me that so many of the planets I feel like are kind of like harmonizing with the spin of the earth. Not necessarily that everything is moving at the same rate. However, everything is kind of harm harmonizing and everything is lining up. And so it's almost like the, the view of the earth or from the earth would be like that of the sun, which would be like that of this planet and of that planet and the other. And as I've been reading a little bit more about this, it's like this is the time for manifesting, the time for like really calling in whatever it is you want. Like this is our time to really make manifest of all the things that we, um, that we want really that our heart is calling us to do. Not like the greedy, like what I want, I want all these greedy, greedy things or whatever, but like more about the actual, what our heart's calling is. And those deep seated desires, it's like now is the time that the universe is in harmony with that. So it's like, as we speak what we want and our intentions and our desires, you know, I see this as like sound waves going out and so as these sound waves are going out, if everything's kind of in alignment and moving just so with us, I feel like it's amplifying our desires from our heart, especially when we speak it or when we can like kind of go into our mind's eye and really sit with that and envision the future that we want, whether it's this afternoon or, you know, for the next 10 years and really truly allowing that vision to sink in and then especially speaking it, I feel like the entire universe is aligning to support it for real. And not only that, you know, we're all up, not we're all, but we're, most of us are up leveling. We're getting energy and um, information and we're all like amplifying and those that aren't get to deal with those densities at their time and their pace. And those that are like, yeah, alignment, feeling good, following heart, feeling some love, going with acceptance and compassion, cause what, that's humaning for real. Then it's almost like our instrument that we're sharing our heart's desires from are more clear, more audible and it's, it's almost like it can reach out with more ease and tap into source and bounce back and really flow into our reality and make manifest this path in front of us. So it's like, for me personally, it's like, this is all great information and I synthesize it in my being every day. And I also talk to a lot of people who are like, yeah, but I live real life. Like, how do I synthesize this? Like, how do I actually create when, you know, Trump, a wall, trafficking, environment, turtles, and you know, the focus is on all the stuff that we don't like necessarily, or well, I still have to meet these goals and I still have to make this timeline and so I can get my bonus, so I take vacation. And we can integrate all of this information so that we really do create this conscious intentional future. Um, so I would just like to put out here that whatever it is that's going on in anyone's life to allow ourselves to be still, have some meditation, get some movement big time, like dance, yoga, go for a walk, stretch, move, wiggle around, do a thing, move your body. Focus on what you want and not what you don't want. Focus on what lights your heart up, not concerning yourself, well, how could I ever do it or be it? Stepping into the space of creativity and creative expression so that more spaces of inspiration are able to flow in. 
activating our sacral space, our sexuality, our sensuality, our creative life force, and trusting that it's safe to do so and that we all deserve to create moving forward. And then remembering that no matter what you do, you can't fuck it up. One, two, that the universe is no joke, literally. Like conspiring and lining up all the planets and everything to say, yeah, home slice, you got this, do it for real. Universe wants to see the earth be this big, beautiful, vibrant love nugget in the cosmos because that's what the earth is. And we are the earthlings. We're the ones that get to bring source energy down in, in us more and bigger and more and bigger and then ground it into the earth and then take up the elemental nature of the love nugget that she is and send it back up and out in gratitude. That's what we get to do as humans, you guys. It's pretty easy peasy. So I wanted to hop on here and share this really quickly. Um, I hope that everyone is enjoying there now and enjoys all of the planets and their direct motion space of no retrograde and just all moving forward. So I hope you all have a lovely rest of your nows. And if you want to support me and my message further than watching this, liking it, subscribing, and sharing, then you can click the link below, people, and support further. I appreciate it immensely. So have a lovely day. Bye.